What's up guys, if you are sick and tired of getting scammed by NBA 2K's packs, make sure to head over to safembamt.com, use code BUGS for 5% off a checkout, and get that cheap, fast, reliable MT that you guys definitely need in this game. What's good YouTube? It's your boy BUGS, back on another NBA 2K21 My Team video, and guys, today, we are going over the auction as per usual before we get into it guys please let's hit 50 likes in this video sub it up comment anything down below i will answer any questions that you comment down below and also not only that there's going to be a locker code down below in the comment section i'm making this before the locker code drops so there will be a new locker code today guys a new locker code it will be down in the comment section down below so uh yeah we're going to talk about the market if you guys need mt i'm selling mt on ps4 for extremely cheap and xbox if you need deals Hit me up. I have a lot of MT on PS4 and Xbox. Make sure to hit me up, man. We have so many deals. But yo, anyways, we're gonna go over to market. As per usual. Um, let's talk about this new filter that we got. So it's double takes pink diamond. This filter is pretty good. And also, if you guys didn't see my pack opening, man, I I'm the pack god. I I'm literally the pack god. So pink diamond right here, man. D Rose at 482, man. Derek freaking rose is looking like a beast and on uh, this night filter right here pink diamond double take should make you a lot of mc it's gonna make you it, it is just trust me gotta stay on it for a little bit since they are impacts man this should go for a lot man i got dwight howard mine's like the eighth on the auction hopefully sells for at least 200k plus that would be awesome but pink diamond double take man if you snipe out derrick rose you're gonna make at least 100k he's probably gonna go for 250 plus he's definitely the rare pink diamond of it i'm pretty sure he's the rare pink diamond so Definitely try out this filter, man. We got a ton of new challenges. So many new challenges. We're going to have to be grinding today, man. Today's a big, big grind day, boys. So let's keep it going, man. Let's talk about this filter, too. I feel like the season of giving Pink Time filter is still going to be pretty good. Unless Dirk is now bio. So yeah, this filter is still going to be good, man. Anything that pops up in this filter, just buy it. You're going to make at least 20k. If you get the worst player, you're still going to make at least 20k. If you get J Rich, if you get Booker, they're going to be a little bit more expensive. Definitely try out this filter. Um, there's a couple other filters that I'm going to go over as well, man. Here's another one that I found very, 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 very good. So here it is. It is Amethyst Double Take. And now why is this good? So we got Hidu Turkulu on this, man. In my opinion, I think Hidu Turkulu is actually going to be a very, very good investment. Same with Patrick Ewing, depending on the price you get him for. Um, Patrick Ewing, if you get him for like 3500 definitely going to be a very good value. Same with Hidu Turkoglu, man. If you guys don't know, man, Hidu Turkoglu is always an amazing investment. No matter what he is, he always goes up in value. And right there, we get one for. Did we get it? Ah, we missed it. So that would have been a pretty good profit, man. 6K for Hidu Turkoglu. That's what I'm saying, man. This filter is going to be good. Honestly, I would say focus on the Patrick Ewing or the Hidu Turkoglu. Um... This is going to be a very good filter, especially for a bunch of ballers. Very, very easily invested in. Uh, I think Hidu's going to drop to around 7k, maybe not. I kind of want to take the risk at 9k, but I'm a little scared because I'm not trying to lose any MT. But uh, put your filter to around 9k. Once again, this is on Xbox Next Gen. Put your filter to around 9k. Let me know how it goes. It should be pretty, pretty good. Um, not totally sure. I'm hoping, I'm hoping, hoping we make a lot of MT from this filter. Um right there i just missed one for 6k so it happens we can't make every snipe but now here's another snipe filter guys sapphire cheapest man since they just dropped a ton of new sapphires um i'm honestly gonna enable it because i have every single nba 20 sapphire so let's see how it is on the enabled um sapphire enabled let's see what t max going for what dominique and all of them are going for so uh the enabled filter is broken so honestly just put your filter to sapphire Put it to around 800 or better yet you can honestly just put your maximum buyout to around 700 and see what pops up this filter might be popping now because of the fact that there is so many sapphires in packs and people are going to throw them up for cheap so honestly put your put your thing to around 700 maybe even 750 let's see if anything pops up in 750 all right so 750 isn't the best um probably a better chance of sapphires pulling up a 700 mt filter should make you a lot of mt and honestly Today, there's going to be a lot of investments. You just got to know when to buy. I think Hidu Turkoglu is going to be the main investment for me. Um, he should be able to go up in value. He is a very good... He's he's amazing. First off, he has range extender. Second off, man, it's Hidu Turkoglu. And not only that, man, Hidu Turkoglu could have clamps on him. You could upgrade him to an absolute beast, and he's so cheap. So, 
I definitely think Hudo Turkoglu is a prime candidate to go up in value. Definitely worth the investment. Like I said, depends what you get him for. He could drop in value. You could lose MC. But right now, it seems like his price will stay around 9K. I'm not sure. He might go cheaper. I'm trying to get him for under 9K, maybe 8K. I feel like 8K is a good price for him. So honestly, sitting on his filter is definitely, definitely, definitely the move. Um, like I said, man, Dwight Howard right there. But uh, let's look at Tommy G's. Let's see if Tommy G's value went up. I saw my 6K yesterday. Waited a little bit longer because I was scared it was going to be a market crash today. So here it is, man. He's at 6K. So if you guys have Tommy G's, man, I'm going to sell them today. 5,900 MT. Going to make a little bit over 2,000 MT per, which in my opinion is a W and a half, man. If you bought 100 at 3K, that's 300K. If you sell them for 59, 5,500, you'll end up with 550K, 250K profit. All right. Is that easy? Um, the amount of MT I made off these Tommy G's is absolutely absurd. We've made so much mc off these tommy g's guys whoever listen to me you're welcome because we've made hundreds and hundreds of thousands of mt so that's why i'm saying please try out the hito turkalu man it's gonna work out trust me when i say this um some other snipe filters let's do it small forward pink diamond eastern this snipe filter to this day is filled with a bunch with a bunch of absolute studs only problem is have a check is on here so Who's on here? Dominique, Grant Hill, Giannis, LeBron James, Vince Carter. Um, and yeah, that's the filter, man. You never know what's going to pop up on filters. That's why you got to be patient. You just got to hope uh, Havlicek doesn't get in the way of you actually getting the snipe. That's what I'm hoping. That's what you guys need to do. Um, bro, this locker code is about to come out. I'm excited for the locker. Hopefully, we get some fire. But yeah, this is definitely a good snipe filter. Um, there's also Pink Diamond Halloween. It's not too good, though, because it's going to take forever. But if you do get a snipe on here... Definitely gonna be insane, man. Especially if you get Vince Carter or, or Harden or LeBron, man. The whole filter's goaded. You just have to get lucky. Um, another good snipe filter right there, man. Uh, yeah, so it looks like 2K didn't drop the lock code at one. So either way, um, there's gonna be a lock code down below in the description. So we're just gonna talk about the market a little bit more. Um, guys, is the market crash? It's decently crashed. If you want to pick up some cards, it's really not a bad time to do so. There will be a bigger market crash maybe next week. Because getting closer to Christmas, man, they usually do drop some decent content. So honestly, guys, right now, what should you guys be doing? Honestly, guys, in my opinion, to make MT right now is definitely investing in Hidu and or Patrick Ewing. Like I said, you don't want to invest for the prices going for you. Want to snipe out the investments. Um, so let's see, 9,500 Manu. Yeah, I mean Hidu. Um, Hidu is definitely the man. The man. he's he's gonna be the best investment. Trust me. Try to get him for 8K and under. That's going to be my investment. And same with Patrick Ewing. Try to get him for 3,300 and under. It's going to be the same thing with Tommy G. And anyways, yo, that's all we got for the vid. Hope you guys enjoyed, man. The lock hole will be down once it drops. And yo, have a good one. Peace. What's up, guys? If you want cheap, fast, reliable MT, make sure to be up on Instagram and Twitter. I am buying and selling MT. Hit me up right now.